Hey there, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> it's only seven minutes after. I should be wrapping up the show by now. My name is Tom Rigsby. This is seven minutes in the morning. Man, I put the gauntlet out there yesterday for somebody to beat Joe. I think he was had it, I already had it typed in, just waiting for me to start. Good morning, Joe. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. When you join, if you are watching live or on the replay, just leave me a comment. Can't beat Joe today. Maybe you can beat him tomorrow, but um, he's already won the contest today. Let's see. I should probably get a prize. Yeah, probably something from the coffee shop. I'll get you something from the coffee shop if you beat Joe saying hi. Just throwing that out there. Hey, Seven minutes in the morning. That's the show. My name's Tom Rigsby, your host. I'm going to get some stuff out of the way here so we can move on or just move on because I'm already late. So it, this is all about that, uh, yeah, beating him saying hi. So yesterday, <clears throat> yesterday I, um, I challenged the audience to greet me in the comments before Joe did because he's, like Johnny on the spot, Joe on the spot. So nobody beat him today. I didn't even get the good morning. This is seven minute, and then it popped up there. So he was on the he was on the ball today. I think he took the challenge <laughs> challenge to heart. Well, the airplanes are out flying around today. Hey, all right. So let's uh, just get into it here. We've been talking this week about does your day run you or you run the day and an important part of that that i mentioned uh, earlier this week was having a system get it out of your head into the system and trust the system well i got some questions about that like well you know what system's best and uh, i've got i've got this planner or i've got this piece of software do you use this do you use that um hang on i'll show you my system i actually wasn't planning on doing that or I would have had it out and ready. Um, my system is a composition book. Yeah, uh, it's not any more complicated than that. And, uh, and this is just the first page out of the book. But the date, whatever I want to write about, my priority for the day, oh, there, priority for the day, things to focus on, people I need to talk to. That's it. That's the whole system right there. Now, if you go through the Fast Five program, which I have been uh, encouraging some folks to do here lately, and there's a link. Oh, let me put the lower third up there so you can see it. There's a link down in the bottom, tomrigsby.com slash Fast Five. That's fast in the number five. Um, there is a system in there. There's some downloadable pages that you can actually download and use for a, a quarterly planner and a daily planner. That's a little more in depth than that. That works for me, but here's the secret. Ready? Drum roll, please. Whatever system you use has to work for you, not you work for the system. How many times you've probably been guilty of this? I've been guilty of this. I think everybody has at some point. We've seen a system. We thought, oh man, that's really cool. I should use that. And then it's a frickin' beating to keep up with everything in there. It doesn't work for you. You're spending more time trying to use it. And, you know, software and apps, they're probably the worst culprit of this. I mean, it's the, you know, the chart's really cool. I could use that. I just have to do this two hours of work every day to put the data in. Is a chart worth two hours of work? I, you know, find the system. <clears throat> Excuse me. Find the system that works best for you and use it. I mean, it's taken me a long time to come up with that system that that's, that's that simple and still lets me get things done. And in all honesty, it's just part of a bigger system. The rest of it's back here on this whiteboard. Right? That's just the part I carry around with me all the time. But the, the bigger system's back on the whiteboard. So whether you use mine um, or somebody else's, doesn't matter. It, it needs to be yours. That's the system that you need to use. Maybe it's index cards. Maybe it's, uh, I had a good friend of mine. I don't think I have any index cards handy. Maybe I've got one in here. Yeah. But he would take a, uh, an index, index card every day. 
Here we go. Just a simple index card like that. Fold it in half this way. And that thing stayed in his uh, chest pocket all day long. That's what he made notes on. That When you fold it in half, that gives it four faces. He used the different faces for different things. Last thing he would do at the end of the day is put that in his uh, assistant's inbox, and she knew what to do with everything. He had, I mean, he did billing on it the whole nine yards. He developed a system that worked for him. So whatever the system is. Now, personally, I would encourage you to um, exercise that system first thing in the morning. That's what works best for me. I know a lot of people like to do it the last thing before they go to bed. That way it's all figured out and set for the next day when they get up. They don't have to think about it. They just pull out their list and go to work. Personally, I like doing it first thing in the morning. And I take time on Sunday afternoons to update the whiteboard back there. That's just my pattern. Find the pattern, find the system that works for you, and use it. Now, all of these pieces that I give you, they're all represented in there. You can only have one priority where focus goes, energy flows, people in, people out. I mean, counting your victories, that's part of the journaling. Beginning the day with an attitude of gratitude, that's in the journal. It's all in there. It's just the way that I use it, right? Every piece of paper, even the one with a great planner on it, printed on it, was blank before it had that printed on it. So start the day with a blank page. So that's my encouragement for the day. I would love to hear from you. If you have a system that you are using that is effective for you, share it with the rest of the 7 Minutes community. I'd love to see it. I bet some other folks would like to see it too. Why do you like it? What do you don't like? not like about it? Um, share that with us. If yours, no, I won't do that. Share it with us. I'll appreciate it. everybody else will too. And if you can beat Joe tomorrow in saying hi in the comments, I'll send you a gift from the coffee shop. There. Challenge affirmed. All right. That's it for today. Really, uh, let's see, is today Thursday? Today is Thursday, so it's Thankful Thursday. You should begin every day from an attitude of gratitude, but especially today, what are you thankful for? You can leave a comment for that as well. That would be awesome. Tomorrow, let's see, tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday, Free Coaching Friday. If you have a question about uh, managing how you spend your time or how you can run your day instead of the day running you leave that or maybe it's a different topic or maybe something that's an idea suggestion topic suggestion for next week and throw those in there also everything's good just send me a message you can either email me tom at tom com or send me a message here on the facebook page either one of those are great that's it for today i'll talk to you again tomorrow you guys have a fantastic day